Hello everybody and welcome back to the Jerry Hammer channel. Um, obviously a lot, of my a lot of my videos haven't had the commentary on but this one is a little bit longer and a little bit more compl complicated than some of the other ones. So uh, we're going to be dealing with getting um, decent level spells earlier on in the game you should get them. Now as you can see uh, we've just defeated um, the Boreal Knight. So what we're going to do, we're going to come down here, we're going to go and talk to Yol, which I'm sure a lot of people already know about anyway, but we're going to get that part of the acquiring of spells out of the way first. Um, so all we need to do is just need to come over this way. We've got a couple of dogs on the other side of there. Now, um, I personally am using a dex and intelligence hybrid for my current playthrough at the moment anyway but for those interested I have decided that if I do do a do just an int playthrough uh, using the sorcerer uh, I'll be using uh, the rapier as my main weapon just because it has such low strength requirements it's really really fast um, and I'll be upgrading that with raw so that I can still then um, enchant it with um, magic damage <laughs> please Grant me death. Undo my shackles. <laughs> right, so we're going to get this through. So take this guy into your service. Might as well get this out of me. Right, so the rest of it is basically going to be um, kind of a series of speedruns. Uh, hopefully I can do it with a lower level character. Uh, I am embered at the moment because I've just defeated the knight. Um, so this should be fun. Get out of the way. Means you can't really speed past these. Always the dogs. Dogs are always the issue in this game. And rats. Rats aren't particularly nice either. Right, so, haven't been through this area, you're going to see a lot of items around. Um, I'm not interested in the items, we're literally just going to go straight for getting the good spells. You don't actually have to kill these ones. As soon as you see an opening, you can just run straight through this. But it's fine, that'd be easier. Right, let's go. That's the first time it's ever dropped for me. Apparently, the extra look that the sorcerer has makes quite a difference. Obviously, you've got the rest bone just there. I suppose we could get that. Right, we're not going to bother any of this. We're just going to run straight past down here. To the right. Hopefully these guys won't follow us. Oh, but they're going to. Just trying to make sure that they don't get um, backed into a situation they don't want to be in at the moment, especially as a sorcerer. It's quite important. Not bother about any of this. Not really bother about you either. Invincibility frames when we're opening the door, so it can't actually hurt us, that's fine. Roll out the doorway. And run down here. Off to the right. Over here. Second bomb fire. Okay, we can't wrestle it, but. We have got the checkpoint, so if we die, this is where we're coming back from. Um, I won't be showing you reruns. If I die, I'll just kind of cut back to where I was, and you'll just see me get past it that way. Now we're going to come here. Where are they? Right, so just wait. There's like a little patrol of lots of enemies, and it'll be far easier to run past this when they're not in the way. So we're going to 
come off here onto this. Where are they? There we go, they're over there now, that's fine. Can we target you? No. Right, I'll get rid of this guy because he's in the way. Okay, we're going to run past all of this crap over here. Hopefully we don't get hit by any of these pots. There we go. Straight up the hill. I don't know whether or not Siegvard will help us here. Literally just trying to survive until the lift gets here. <laughs> nope, Siegvard isn't going to help us with these guys. It's a shame. Alright, so I reckon we wait where we'll be able to circle around them. Okay, let's try and kill this guy. Down the lift. Hopefully they don't follow us down here. Okay, here is another pretty dangerous spot. Hopefully we get away with it. Sneakily get this. So we're just going to lure this guy up the steps. Hopefully past this pillar, and then around the back of him, and we are through. Now this frost knight, he won't come past this door, so feel free to um, take him out with soul arrows from this doorway if you feel like uh, taking him on, get yourself some extra souls. healing right there. Wow, he didn't actually reset properly. That's interesting. Right, so now we're going to go down here. Under there. What about you? Let's so regain some stamina. We're going to go around this way. Not bothered about those. He's going to do this thing. Not bothered about that either. Roll well down here. Turn right, not left. Here, across the bridge. These guys aren't going to bother with this either. See, so can run past all these because they activate so slowly. So, just got a new vampire. Activate that. We've got a new checkpoint. And then down here, we've got um, some guys with trees. These can be a pain. Hopefully we can just slide by them though. Whoa. Both got me. Ooh, we got heals. That's fine. Right then. I'm going to follow this wall to the left. Don't bother getting involved in any of this. Follow it to the left. To the left, to the left, to the left. As you can see, now I've got this mound on the right. We're going to go this way. Hang on, right. Dog below us. We might get invaded as well uh, by an NPC. But as long as we tag this, we're all golden. Skip your reset. Oh, no. Damn dog. Cool, so we're almost there. And then 
then we need to go over this way. I suppose we should probably take this dog out before it gets out of hand. Stop bouncing around. Alright, there we go. Alright, so in here, there's only one enemy we really need to kill, and that is this guy. Otherwise, things get really nasty in here. Run past the other guy. In fact, you know what? We will kill him. That gets us a pretty good staff while we're at it. Upstairs, we'll have a quick heal up here. And we've got Spearman on the right, just inside this doorway. He's going to be a pain. Oh, we get lucky. Oh, that's fine. That's cool. Through this little broken doorway. Steps. And here we have. Well, this is unexpected. I don't often have visitors. What do you want? This is my study that you've happened upon. If you haven't any business, I've reading to get back to. There we go. This guy will teach us some pretty decent sorceries, especially for this stage of the game. So we're going to get him to go back to Fighting Shrine. How intriguing. Very well. Indeed, I am a sorcerer. Yeah, we'll get to well, we'll get all this. Um, thing to be aware with him is um, if you defeat um, four bosses before you give him any scrolls, he'll disappear from Fly Link. So make sure that obviously you know you, you use um, that to your advantage. Make sure you go and grab a scroll before you start fighting too many bosses after finding him. But um, when we go back to Fly Link now, we should have. Um, decent selection of spells available to us. Let's just get out of here. Look at that. Yeah, I don't really want to deal with all this. So let's uh, let's get through here. Sorry, guys. Um, Obviously, you can either skip ahead or just watch it. I've not got any homeward bones, so I'm just going to run back to the bonfire. Go! Let's jump off that. Cool, so that's given us the Dark Moon Lady, and then we have, should have uh, Yol should be down here, which is, and then the other guy, can't remember his name, he did just tell me, is just down here, next to the blacksmith. Oh, you're back then. And so here we have um, some rather interesting spells to be playing with. Spook's obviously really good um, for trying to get around with less aggro from enemies. You've got magic weapon, fire and flash sword, soul great sword. Um, so yeah, that gives us access to a good number of spells really early in the game. Like I say, we've only just defeated um, Knight of the Burial Valley. Is that right? Yeah. So, hope that helps guys. Uh, feel free to leave me a like and I'll catch you next time.